name is Joseph Marsh, and I am a sales and enablement engineer here at Esri. Today, I will share with you some of Esri's out-of-the-box capabilities to be able to bring together disparate data sets and transform them into incredibly useful information products. Here, we are looking at an easy-to-configure dashboard on transmission weather warnings. We combined extreme weather conditions from NOAA, AccuWeather, and weather decision technologies with a transmission data set. Using these real-time data sets together with our assets enables electric utilities to visualize and be alerted when extreme weather might threaten the safety of their workers and the reliability of their grid. Let's go ahead and take a look at this particular storm. Here we are seeing a number of lightning strikes represented by the plus symbol. And we can go ahead and turn on a substation buffer that has 20 miles around our sensitive substations and see where these lightning strikes are landing, potentially within an area of a substation to cause damage. It'll go ahead and represent these lightning strikes in your substations in this list right here, as well as send out warning notifications via email and text message. The other half of this dashboard is around galloping transmission lines. Galloping is a event where a transmission line becomes covered in ice and then perpendicular winds start to make them gallop or jump rope. This can cause irregular skater readings that without this dashboard would end up sending costly field workers out for inspection. So I can go ahead and select one of these and it'll highlight the particular segments that are experiencing galloping conditions. And it'll also alert the right field workers and the right decision makers about these conditions in order to reduce costs with field surveys. What you've just seen is a great example of how using the ArcGIS platform can address one of the biggest challenges utilities face, which is bringing together disparate information to address threats to their grid. Thank you.